What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor DVDJ and use code YOURBOYBUGS for 10% off a checkout. And yeah man, check them out. What's good YouTube, it's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we got My Team Talk, I believe it is episode 6 guys. Make sure to drop that like, 20k in the comments, like the vid sub if you are new. And oh my AI just sold, made a quick... About 6k off and gone for around 84k. So, yeah, about 6k made off the AI. Yeah, guys, let's get this video to at least 60 likes for a chance of winning 20,000 MT to a couple guys on my Twitter. So, make sure to go hit that Twitter. If you guys need MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor. And yeah, man, pretty much in these episodes, we just go over like MT methods, tokens, whatever. We just pretty much go over the game, what's wrong with the game. We pretty much talk about my team in general and what you guys should be doing with mt and whatnot so let's talk about it man we got my team talk and honestly bro right now i am a little confused and honestly i want you guys to comment and let me know what you guys think about all this stuff and what's going on so right now we got these prime packs which do expire thursday so i'm expecting content thursday possibly a new spotlight i'm not sure i feel like they might hold off the spotlight considering it is all-star week and all-star moments and all-star stuff dropping this whole entire week and i am so prepared for it but now we got the series two which honestly i feel like is a staller for content it's just terrible content um in my opinion all it really does is just make card collector holders get higher which is terrible um personally it helped me out not gonna lie but other than that I don't know, man. I don't know how I feel about it. I just really think they need to drop better content. And I think All-Star Moments is coming out very soon. So when All-Star Moments does come out, it's going to be pretty interesting. The market should crash. And um, yeah, prices should definitely drop. And also, I want to show you one thing. I just want to show you how much the market is up right now. And it's insane. So... Right off the bat, bro, I just saw how Hakeem sell for 250k. Hakeem. This one has 21 minutes left with 165k. I got Hakeem yesterday for 127k. No joke. It is on my Twitter. 127k. And I got my Bosch yesterday for 110. Bosch isn't even on the auction, bro. He's probably like 180k. So, <coughs> also, I got a Shaq yesterday for 100k. And I'm selling him. Right now, he looks like he's going for about 145, 150. So... I don't know what happened. Oh, look, Bosch, 195K. I'm about, I'm throwing him up right now. Right this second, Bosch is going on the market. And I believe mine does have diamond contracts. So, uh, personally, right now, I am going to sell most of my cards in this video. I'm probably going to throw a bird, too. I really do believe there's going to be a giant, giant market crash. So, wish me luck, man. I'm trying to have as much MT as possible. I got the Wade there too. But uh, yeah, it's kind of crazy how much everything is. And I really want you guys to take advantage of it and make sure to sell your cards. But yeah, other than that, man. So tokens, man. If you guys need to get your tokens up, bro. Heat check are pretty... Like, this is what I got. So I have 1,200 tokens. I have... I, pretty, I could enter the Galaxy Opal stage and almost get my first Galaxy Opal. But uh, yeah, man, it's crazy how close I am to my first Galaxy Oval. And I pretty much did it because the new collection dropped. And I did get the 300 tokens that I will show you right here. I just got these 300 tokens. And yeah, I'm actually kind of happy. Got those 300 tokens. Now I have 1,200 tokens. I have around three pink diamonds bought. I bought Patrick Ewing just because I love Patrick Ewing. I'm a Knicks fan, so... Um, yeah, Patrick Ewing, we got buy five more cards, which is equivalent to 750 tokens. And then I will have, wait, five cards, 150 times two, 300, 600, 750 tokens. That means I will have around 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, around 500 tokens extra. So I'll have 500 tokens extra. That means I am short by about 250 tokens for my first Galaxy Opal in NBA 2K20. And I'm honestly kind of hyped. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm saving up for a token market. If you guys do really want to buy some players on a token market, I would definitely wait. These players are garbage. I already bought the Paul Millie, the Reggie Lou. But yeah, I would not recommend buying anything. We should see a token market update this week or next week. But yeah, right now, man, if you really want to pop packs, I'm not even going to lie. These packs are straight heat. Like, 
These packs have been treating me well. I pulled diamonds like crazy. Not only that, pretty much if you pull anything, you dub out. Like, that emerald probably goes for around 3k. So, alright, I took a mini L there. But if you pull a pink diamond Giannis or any pink diamond, bro, you make so much MT. Oh, there we go, an amethyst. So now, I'm going to make my money back off this pack, guaranteed. And fill up my collection. I believe there's new jerseys in here. Do we just get Kyrie? Oh, no, do we get Karis LeVert? Ah, I sold him earlier for around 8k. There's a lot to do right now on my team. And honestly... I think they're pretty much setting us up for a giant market crash Friday or Saturday. I believe the All-Star Weekend does start Friday. But I don't know, man. I'm waiting for some stuff to pop up and whatnot. I'm really, really thinking something crazy might happen Saturday. That's my guess. Not totally sure, though. Oh, I should have quick sold them. Uh, I really hope something big does happen. That will be really, really cool. Um... Oh, two rubies. Oh, I have both of them. I'll put them up on the auction. Um, But yeah, man. Right now, if you guys have like no MT, you got to sell your team, man. It sucks to sell your team and stuff, especially if you play a lot of online games. But I'm just going to tell you guys, if you don't, you're just going to be really sad. Like, you're going to lose mad MT. If you don't have MT stocked up and whatnot, you're going to be sad when all those prices drop and you still have your team and you don't have a chance to make MT or do anything at all. Um, right now, also, I noticed Jimmy Butler's price was really low and I feel like it should go up. I'm going to show you in a second. I got him on a bid for 55k and I think it's going up already. I believe he's around 80k. For some reason, man, there's some days during 73k. Okay. There's some days during the auction, bro. I don't know what's going on, but if you pay attention to the auction as much as I do, sometimes cards get spammed. Oh my God, Wade's at 245. Goodbye, Wade. Sometimes cards get spammed like crazy for no reason. Like you'll see 15. I, this is why I got Wade before because I saw like 20 D Wades up around two minutes. They all pretty much posted around the same time. And that is exactly why I picked one up and that's why I'm selling him right now. I saw so many D Wades at once. That's when you could sneak bids in and get them for cheap. Because if there's so many going on at once, you're going to end up snagging one for the low. And that's exactly what I did. I got them for around 150, 160. And I'm about to sell them for 200 plus. That's another tip for you guys. You just do have to have a lot of MT. I do understand that. A lot of people in this game should have at least over 100K MT. Honestly, at this point in the game, um, you, could, you should have at least 100K sitting here. Even if you don't and you have a pretty decent team, I would recommend selling your team and getting as much MT as possible because right now is definitely the best day to sell, especially with new content dropping any possibly today, tomorrow. New content will be dropping for sure, so just stay tuned for that. 2K usually takes a giant uh, turning point during these times. Like... Uh, when they do, when all-star content comes around, bro, they usually, their game kind of switches and they kind of take off. Like this is the really, this is usually when 2K starts getting better. They start making updates. More people start playing. Cause dude, football season's over. They have to start making this game better or no one's going to play it again next year. Um, so right now, I don't know, man, there's a lot going on. Personally, like I said, this, what's it called? This series, bro, is a complete collection filler that's all it is if you think diamond pink diamond lebron and pink diamond Giannis are good dude they're not good they're literally collection fillers i mean honestly pink diamond Giannis is probably good it's it is Giannis, but nah pink diamond lebron bro i'm gonna show you stats he's not good whatsoever i'll compare him bro he has a 95 0 and 88 defense that is the worst lebron in the game he, he's garbage he can't even Dude, Maurice Lucas blows him away. He's 40K. So, if you really think this pink dollar LeBron's usable, he would get clamped up by anybody I have. So, I'm just saying. But yeah, other than that, man, hope you guys enjoyed the video. So, the little, little like, um, outcome of this video, bro. Make sure to sell your cards. Um, make sure to try that snipe filter out. And also, make sure to save your tokens. But yeah, other than that, I, it's really all I got. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Stay tuned for more content tomorrow and whatnot. Hope you guys enjoy. Peace.